Hey guys, Firecracker260 here today doing a mock review of the Helium Empire spaceship from the new John Carter movie. And if you've seen it, then you'll know that the Helium is a race of human-looking Martians. So, um, I, they also, they have this really good spaceship, this really amazing spaceship in the movie, and I decided to build that in Lego, plus a few figures, characters from the movie. So, we'll get into the minifigures first. So here are the characters. First we have John Carter, and he's probably the most accurate out of all of them to the actual characters from the movie. And he's pretty straightforward, really easy design. That's him. Then we have, I believe it's Deja or Daja or something, the uh, Princess of Mars, so they call her. Um, so that's her. And I'm not really fond of this figure. I don't think she turned out that good. And I plan to um, improve a majority of these figures and make them look better in the future. Uh, but anyways, here's the Thern leader. I'm not sure if he has a name in the movie or not. Uh, I forget. But he has a teleporting device, which they, which all of the Therns have. And in case you don't know, the Therns are these basically evil guys that choose the fate of Mars and whatnot, so I believe I I believe that's what they do. And then he has the sword and a Lex Luthor headpiece. Here we have a helium guard. And yeah, he has um samurai armor there because I thought this armor would look nice on him. And yeah, shield. That's him. And then we have another helium guard. This one's more simple, straightforward. He's got a gun. And yeah, that's the other guard. So here's the spaceship, and I made it levitated. Like, it's on these transparent stands, so it's not actually on the ground. I thought that would look nice. And in my opinion, it does. So I'll start with the front. We have, um, like, this castle tower piece that I turned sideways to make the um, domed shape of the front of the ship. I don't really know what these are called. I don't know what their purpose in this shape is. It's just there and it looks really nice. Um, the cockpit area where someone can sit in there. Uh, then those bizarre wing things which I believe help like reflect sunlight. I, these things, this kind of spaceship's like solar powered or something. It sails on, um, what do they call it? Like just sun waves or whatever? Light waves? So I believe these in the movie help it fly and like absorb energy or whatever. Uh, to the cockpit, a satellite piece up top. Not to act as a satellite, but just there for detailing. Uh, engine with those blue transparent pieces. In the back we have more like sun absorbing plates and a compartment to store the guards so they can prepare for battle or whatever. The helium guards. And yeah, the transparent pieces are just like the transparent cylinder pieces. And uh, this is it from a sky view. And yeah, that's basically all there is to say about the Helium ship. I believe I covered everything. Uh, so yeah, Firecracker260, signing off. Bye.